We've been observing a sun-like star called 55 Cancri, star 55 in the constellation Cancer, for 19 years. And we watch the wobble of this star as it's yanked on by the planets orbiting it. And so far now we've found four planets and we're just now announcing the discovery of the fifth planet, the first planetary system with five full planets orbiting the sun-like star. There is an intriguing, mysterious gap uh, between the fourth planet out around 55 Cancri and the Jupiter-like planet that's far away. In that gap, we don't know what there is. Our current technology would be able to detect big planets like Neptune, Saturn, Jupiter. We don't see any of them. So if there are any planets there, they must be smaller, the size of the Earth. Uh, and in fact, it's a little hard to imagine that there's just nothing there in this big gap. So the suggestion is there might be small, rocky planets like Venus, Mars, or Earth. This planet, we think, is likely to have a fairly substantial atmosphere. It's very massive. It might not be the sort of place that at least life as we know it would find to be a very uh, comfortable environment. However, this planet, in fact, orbits in what we call the habitable zone. So what we're doing right now is, with our observational technique, the Doppler technique, is uh, taking really the very first steps to finding um, Earth-like planets. We're going to find, you know, we'll basically give NASA the addresses, the names and addresses of the most likely candidates for Earth-like planets.